Two men appear in Josephine County Court today for the first time after prosecutors say they murdered 43-year-old Crescent City man Roger Huntington. Both men are being held without bail. NBC5 News was in court today for their arraignments and spoke with Huntington's brother, who says Roger will be deeply missed. Um, out of five brothers and sisters, it's just me and my sister left. And so my mom's not taking it real well. A tragedy leaving Gold Hill man Charlie Mott with a huge void. Friday night, Oregon State Police found his brother, Roger Huntington, dead in his black Chevrolet trailblazer at the Lake Selmac boat ramp near Selma. He was supposed to be on his way up to see my, my son. My son lives in Ashland and he was supposed to be going up there to visit with him. And so it came to a shock to find out that he didn't make it. Two men have been arrested in connection with his death, 22-year-old Carol Ballard and 20-year-old Blake Sibley, both Texas residents. They both appeared in court for the first time Monday. They're being held without bail in the Josephine County Jail on multiple charges, including murder. That's a life sentence with a possibility of parole after serving 25 years. So the youngest defendant is 20 years old. So he, if convicted, is going to be in his mid-40s if he was released. But even if the men are convicted and serve the maximum time, Mott says it won't bring his brother back. My brother had a heart of gold. Uh, I've, I've actually been with him on a cold day where he ran across someone cold, and he actually took his jacket off and gave it to him. But he says he's glad the two are behind bars, so no one else has to lose a sibling to their actions. There is still a third suspect on the loose. Police are looking for 23-year-old Marshall William McKenna. He is also a Texas resident. Police say he could be armed and dangerous. He's described as 5 foot 9, 160 pounds with blonde hair and green eyes. If you see him or know where he might be, you're asked to call 911.